you take some time to relax. And like, and I know that that in and of itself can be very hard to find. Like a lot of like my gripes with myself is like, oh, you're not making progress. You're not working on the things that you need. But sometimes you got to sit down and realize what you need is to just do nothing, or just actually have a chill day. Like people, people are so down on like, it's like, oh well. They're, so, like, how can you be relaxing when yada yada, da 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 da? It's like, no. Up. I, wrong button. A part of the. Another part of the human condition is the need for entertainment. Like, that sounds stupid. Like, a lot of people, like, especially in the society that we live in, it's like. Entertainment? That's a, that's a luxury. No, it's not. Fuck anybody that says it's just a luxury. Like, you don't need that. Yeah, look, Maslow's Pyramid of Needs and all that shit. It's like, oh, food, water, this and this. It's like, no. We developed uh, a big fucking, fucking meaty brains. Unlike this guy. You see this guy? This is Dodo. They didn't go extinct because they're stupid. That's actually here. Let's do a little, little side, little side note, a little biology stuff. Dodos were not dumb. Um, actually, hell, I, I love talking about animals and stuff like that. So... Dodos are actually, believe it or not, their lineage is the same animal that wiped out the saber-toothed tiger. I shit you not. That is, that is a, this, this thing, this little fucking animal right here, this thing wiped out the saber-toothed tigers. And that was more factors than just, than just like they ate them or something like that. It's like, so you've seen like ostriches and emus and stuff like that. These were even bigger. These are like the size of moas. Another extinct animal. Uh, that one's a little more recently extinct than the, than the predecessor to it. Uh, basically, nine foot tall murder chickens. Nine foot tall. Nine foot tall murder chickens and they uh, they just became the dominant predator and the saber-toothed tiger uh, just like... I mean, it, it became like other species like, you know, you got like your mountain lions and stuff like that but they they couldn't adapt so, anyways, off that side note, it's like, this guy, you know what he doesn't need? He doesn't need entertainment. He needs food, he needs water, he needs shelter, he needs to not get eaten by, by people. Ah, shit, I messed up. To, to say they're not stupid is what happened is the dodos uh, got isolated on an island, and because it's an island, having a nine-foot-tall size and super meat-eating appetite did not help it. So it stayed apex predator and slowly evolved smaller and smaller until, like, it got to this size. And it had always been the apex predator, so it didn't it didn't have a concept of fear. So it just it just waddled its fat ass up to like Europeans, who were like, "Oh my god, this is the easiest to catch chicken I've ever seen." And that's how they died. They weren't actually stupid, as they had no concept of fear. It's crazy. Anyways, so like this guy on the Mas he doesn't have a Maslow's pyramid. He has like a Maslow's shitty triangle. It's like I need food, I need water. I don't even really need shelter, but he has this nice cave, so he's he's got luxury right here. But humans need luxury. You need luxury, or not luxury, you need entertainment. You need entertainment in your life. Because, like, you're a very, very complex animal. You're the complexest animal on, on the on the dang planet. You got uh, you got that front brain, what do you call it, the frontal lobe. It's got all these decision making and like, it, what's it good for? People say it's good for math and making you sad. Well, it's making you sad because it needs stimulation. It needs some kind of entertainment. If you don't have entertainment in your life, like, or or something, or just something you enjoy, if you don't have that, you're just gonna make yourself more miserable. And it's not because like, oh, well, I just need to work harder to get it. No, that's bullshit. Like, like a good example is like. One of the most popular sports in, like, countries that are very poor is, like, soccer. Because soccer doesn't require a lot of equipment. Do you, do you, do you look at those people and say, oh, well, that soccer, that soccer is a luxury. It's like, no. You look at that and it's like, oh, it's the one thing they have to enjoy. So they, they enjoy it. Like, just because you might live in a country that's much more well-off or, or luckier or what have you does not mean, like, you aren't also entitled to that. It's, it's the same basic concept. Everybody in every country is generally generally the same you're people you're humans and humans have needs